It's funny when you make a comic book movie, a lot of people find meaning in things where we never meant it. Um, and, 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 it and people read into things in, in a certain way. Um, but but that, that wasn't. And I, I'm sorry, but to, what was the first part of that? I'm oh, oh, great question. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. No, we took, you know, what was fun about it was we were able to kind of pick and choose certain elements from the comic book past, um, the past comic books, and use kind of what we wanted here, and maybe we'll use a little bit of that. Um, so there's a little bit, I guess, of killing joke with the idea of a, of a, of a, wanna, of a failed stand-up comedian. But, you know, another big influence of this movie and the thing that inspired the original creators of Joker was the silent film The Man Who Laughed, which is really where this started. Um, it's funny because the co-writer, Scott Silver, emailed me this morning our first emails back and forth. He was saying, congratulations, it's exciting. And he sent me our first emails back and forth. And I was reading them, and it was all about The Man Who Laughed. And... Um, I almost forgot that in the process of that being such a big inspiration for us.